Hey guys, it's X from here today, bringing you guys another gameplay slash commentary on YouTube. And today for you guys, I have a 25 to 5 FFA gameplay with the P90 on the map countdown, so I hope you enjoy it. And in today's video, I'm going to be talking about my thoughts on COD 4. And I've already done this on MW3 and Bold at War, but I will be doing this on, on the COD 4, obviously this video, and I'll be doing one on Black Ops 2 soon as well. And I've actually been really enjoying Black Ops 2 lately. I've been running in a party and going for swarms. And just a minute ago, I actually got four swarms. I got one random class generator swarm. I got a swarm with the LSAT and a swarm with the SVU sniper. And that that swarm was pretty um, cool. So I'll bring I'll make sure to bring that out for you guys on the uh, in in the near future somewhere. But yeah, so I've actually been enjoying that. So it'll probably be quite a good review on that one actually. Uh, but yeah, anyway, the really good things about COD 4. Are uh, the over uh, overpowered weapons? No, there there aren't really over any overpowered weapons, and I really like that because on a lot of the games, there are just weapons that really stand out. It's, I think actually Black Ops 2. I don't think there's any weapons that really stand out, but say like NW3 versus the ACR and MP7, and that's like the only gun that everyone uses. And on Black Ops 2, everyone's using different guns, and and it's the same on COD 4. And there's like there's good guns like the AK-47, the P90 is my favourite, the MP5. And the M16 with Red Dot is actually a bit overpowered, but other than that, I think they're pretty much perfect with all the guns. And Quad 4 is also really good because the 357 kill streaks, I really like them. Uh, like World at 1 Quad 4 both have 357 kill streaks. It's really simple, and it's mainly down to gun skill. Gun skill. So, like, say on Black Ops 2, you just if you get a load star, you're automatically pretty much got a really good gameplay. And on this, like, it's all down to gun skill. And I just prefer it that way because like kill streaks I think I like them but some of them are a bit overpowered say like the load star I really think that needs a bit to be, bit of a buff because it does shoot really quick I think it's already been buffed before but I think they should buff it again but anyway another thing is um that I really actually there's one thing I don't like and that's probably juggernaut uh juggernaut is pretty annoying I know you can kind of counter that by using stop and power but it's still it really does increase your health a lot but I think I've only used it in like one of my gameplays, but I don't even know. I, I don't even know why I had it on, but I don't usually use that. I usually use stop and power. If not, I probably use uh, UAV jammer, but I don't really often. I used to use that all the time, but I use stop and power now most of the time. But yeah, and uh, it was funny actually because when I first got my HDPVR and started YouTube, I think my first ever video I posted was a um, quad four triple clap. And it's, as soon as I got my HDPVR, set it up with a few mates and recorded and I um, put, pulled out a sniper and I hit my first triple clap and I'd never hit a sniper um, clip like that before and I hit it as soon as I set my HDPVR up which is pretty funny so I uploaded it straight away even though I was camping but you know I'm not a sniper so and um, I just like to say these are my opinions on COD 4 you guys may have different opinions on what I'm, I've been saying but at the end of the day it's my own opinion if you disagree with me make sure to tell me in the comment section but anyway guys i hope you enjoyed the video if you haven't already don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i hope you all have a very nice day peace <laughs>